Western Michigan University made a historic announcement this morning unveiling one of the largest donations to a public university in history. It is a $100 million donation to help get the new WMU School of Medicine up and running. We are joined live by WMU President Dr. John Dunn. Thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you very much, Sue. It's nice to talk with you. Nice to see you. Well, this is an incredible gift for the School of Medicine at Western. It's been in the works for a while. We know that. How will the money donated today, though, be used to set things up? Tell us about it. Well, the very good news about the donation today is that the, the uh, gift is restricted to the development of the WMU School of Medicine, but it's unrestricted in the sense of how we use it. And we have uh, recently a new founding dean, uh, Dr. Hal Jensen, that's joined us. And uh, he and his team will be working, along with the president and others, to make some very critical decisions about uh, the best expenditure of those dollars. We certainly have a plan. We're on, on uh, pathway uh, to uh, what we think will be a really, truly great school of medicine. Tell us a little bit about where the project stands right now with setting up the curriculum, when maybe the first students will be accepted to the medical school. Thank you very much. We have a number of committees that we've formed. We've been doing a lot of good work, including a curriculum committee, a facilities committee, a finance committee, all of the things that you need to establish uh, to satisfy the liaison committee on medical education and their uh, certification requirements. Um, so all of that is, is, is going very, very well. We're very pleased about that. Um, and in that sense, we're, we're on time. We now have uh, uh, met uh, the first uh, requirement uh, with respect to LCME. That's exciting news too. Tell us a little bit about the partnership with some of the hospitals in the area. How will that work? Excellent. Uh, we're very pleased. As you know, we have uh, two outstanding hospitals here, uh, Bronson and Borges, uh, and they are truly uh, partners in this endeavor. It's uh, uh, coordination, cooperation, teamwork. That's what this is all about. And this great gift that we have received today is really a gift not only to Western Michigan University, but to the region, to the state. Uh, it, it's really a gift recognizing that uh, together and collectively we can do marvelous things, and we will. Right. Well, we've seen the promise in the Kalamazoo area, an exciting initiative. Now this large medical school donation. How do you think this is going to shape the future of Western? We heard a little bit earlier about trying to get some of the younger people to stay and, and root here in southwest Michigan. Well, we know that, uh, uh, unfortunately, the, the number of talented young people seeking opportunities in medical schools that we are not at capacity, we have not met the capacity, and we have many, many qualified students that uh, we're just not able to uh, respond to their needs and provide opportunities and seats in medical schools for them. So we want to make sure that not only students in Michigan that are highly qualified, but also students within the nation that are seeking a great opportunity at a great university, and uh, we will be home for them. If we do that and do it well, we'll be very, very uh, successful in making sure our citizens in the state of Michigan and their health care needs are, are met. Well, that's a wonderful donation and a wonderful start to this. Congratulations today, and thank you so much for joining us tonight. Thank, thank you very much for your time. Bye-bye.